In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to use JIRA plans. If you've ever felt that orchestrating tasks and managing projects on JIRA is a bit overwhelming, you are certainly not alone. Planning is one of the key elements to streamline your workflow, and luckily JIRA offers a feature called plans that can help you visualize and organize your work effectively. We'll walk through the steps to create a JIRA plan and explore how to leverage it for your project management needs. Let's dive in. First, you want to locate the Your Work section in JIRA. This is essentially your command center where you can access all personal task updates and keep track of your assignments. Make sure you're logged into your JIRA account to begin. Head over to this section by clicking on Your Work from the navigation menu. Here, you'll encounter an overview of your recent and favorite activities. It's this area where we'll be able to set the foundation for creating new plans. Next, find the Plans option. It should be located within or under the Your Work section. Clicking on it will take you to the hub of all planning activity in JIRA. So why is this important? Well, seeing all your plans in one place as a list can be incredibly helpful. It provides clarity and allows you to jump back into project mode without missing a beat. Once you're in the plan section, you'll want to create a new plan. Click on the Create Plan button. This is where the thoughtful process of organizing your myriad tasks begins. Plans in JIRA enable you to manage team progress, capacity, dependencies, and timelines. They are invaluable for project managers or anyone who needs visibility into the status of task completion within Teams. After hitting the Create Plan button, you'll be prompted to name your plan. Choose a name that is intuitive and reflective of the project it will encapsulate. A descriptive name helps teammates quickly understand the plan's purpose without needing to dig into the details. For example, naming it something like Q1 Marketing Campaign is much clearer than something vague like Project 1. Upon naming your plan, click on the Open button to launch it. Opening your plan for the first time gives you a blank canvas. It's practically shouting for you to add structure and bring your organization mastermind game to life. At this stage, you don't see much action, but as we fill it up, it will serve as a comprehensive map of your project journey. In terms of privacy, you have the option of setting your plan to be private. This is useful when you're drafting initial ideas and aren't ready for team visibility yet. However, depending on your team's workflow, a more open approach might serve you better. Transparency often fosters collaboration and invites constructive feedback from team members. Now this is where the real fun begins, adding work to your plan. You're given the flexibility to include different aspects like a board, project or filter, depending on what integrates best with your project structure. Let's consider these options a bit closer. Adding an existing project brings in all the issues and tasks related to that project seamlessly into your plan, ready for further scheduling and prioritization. If your chosen option is a board, you'll need to select which board to add to your plan. Boards in JIRA are visual tools that display issues from a project or filter across different columns in which they stand in the workflow. This setup aids in visual tracking of task progress at a glance, which can be quite enlightening, especially in sprint planning. You can also choose to select a team, although this is optional. Associating a team with your plan personalizes it further by including team-specific tasks and subtasks. Imagine having a dedicated team view where individual workloads and responsibilities are highlighted, helping balance work distribution and preventing burnout. Finally, click on the Create button to finalize and bring your new plan to life. This step talks to the backend system and sets up all the intricate connections that make your plan effective. The satisfaction from clicking create is akin to hitting save after writing a compelling article. There's a sense of accomplishment knowing that your conceptual plan has transitioned into reality within JIRA. There you have it, a clear step-by-step -step guide on using JIRA plans. This feature not only helps you organize current tasks, but also gives you the foresight to plan ahead efficiently. Whether you're managing a small project or orchestrating a company-wide campaign, JIRA plans act as your strategic blueprint to navigate through task management complexities. Give it a try and see how much smoother your workflow becomes. Thanks for watching and happy planning.